so kind. What's that tree remind you of? Which one? The one with the curve in it. I don't know. Boomerang? Well, I was thinking how some girls stand. <laughs> <laughs> Zeke, come here, buddy. Well, that was cool. Zeke, dude. Scared me, buddy. You don't know me, son. Eleven. Eleven. Both hands. Alright, there it goes. I just want you to know I chopped the majority of that tree down. He's just a camera hog. What are you saying? Nothing, don't worry about it. Mm, tough life. Cutting down trees, 15 trees. We got more than that. Did we? We have 15 logs on the ground. Yeah. So it's probably 10 trees or less. That was a good day. Yeah. So close together. Fine day to cross the bridge, ain't it? Good day for carrying logs. Oh, yes, sir, indeed. Who's going to make the log? Who's gonna carry the logs? These guys. These traps right here. <laughs> <laughs> Caused a lot of misery in its day. So he can't do anything. He can't do anything right. I'm existing on a level up here, mentally, physically, emotionally, spiritually. You are. Listen here. If I had a shovel. I hey couldn't buddy. reach it. Hey buddy, you better watch your tone, right? Yeah? Uh -huh.
sourdough bread made from scratch with these hands. Potatoes, rice, onions, bell peppers, pinto beans, chicken, Taco Bell seasoning. It's okay. Forty seventh try. <laughs> Bring. I have it so low. I have my tripod. Oh, you yeah. in there? Hmm? And I say, we can make bread now. I don't know about that. Flour, water, and a banana. Could you imagine if we had sugar? Crazy pizza hair. Can you cook a pizza? Actually, with the bread? Yeah. Alright, what are you doing then? You want my brother bring a tomato sauce? Yeah. Bring, have him bring tomato sauce, cheese, and pepperoni. That's all we need, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, dude. That's his bandana because he has lung problems. No, I don't. It's dusty. He's weak. Here. Says 165 pound Josh. Oh, it fits! Let's go! Oh, you the whole cabin comes out. <laughs>
let them know we're crazy. We're just building cabins wherever we want. Yeah, <coughs> we're not changing tires, we're changing logs. No, it's not. I say we grab some more locks over the days and line this whole bottom too. Not the whole bottom, but at least put one in the center and stuff. Just in case. To ja jack it up and do it? Or just put in there? Yeah. It would look cool. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. All right. Why didn't you guys put the rocks down before you built the cabin? Well, that's a great question. Why did we do that? We, we thought we were going to do something else. Oh. Right? Yeah. We thought we were going to do cinder blocks. <sighs> we have cairns holding our... Zeke. Stuck truck. <laughs> sir, you can't park there. <laughs> yeah, sir. Hey, this is the way to get it out, right? <laughs> what are you cooking? Oh, me? A little bit of biscuits and gravy. Now life's like sharpening an axe. It takes time to get the edge just right. So if you rush it, it's brittle. Don't pay attention. How about you quit talking? away with it. Drop. 
morning. Hello, neighbor. Hello. How you doing over there? Oh, good. Just building a house. Oh, it's my dandy house you got there. New to the neighborhood. Yeah, I see you just right across the street. Yeah. All my these houses here are recycled. Wow. Yeah. A green community. <laughs> About as green as it comes. <laughs> Everything locally sourced. I love that. Yeah. I can't wait till I tell Marge. Oh, Marge is with you. Marge you came sly down. dog, you. Marge, of course, came down. Oh. She just can't get enough of what we're doing. That's delightful. How are the HOA fees? Ah, arm and a leg. Two turkey feathers. Brutal. Brutal. All right, well, I got dinner cooking. Oh, you do it now? I'll catch you later. I'll bring over some biscuits for you later. Oh, you, you big biscuit guy. Big biscuit guy. Big biscuit All right, guy. see you later. Bye-bye. I don't need your help over here. Let's see you. He just wanted to be more in the spotlight. He's probably going to cut it out until I'm not even in this. You're not on it. Oh my god! Lower the beam! How's that for your <coughs> Kentucky measurement? That's perfect. <coughs> Try jumping. <coughs> Dude, it's not gonna work. I don't know what we're gonna do. What? What's that over there? Where there was one, now there is two. <laughs> Now, boy, are you sure you know how to skin logs? <laughs> that reminds me of that, uh, that one scene from Jeremiah John. I haven't seen a live man in two months. I'm Bear Claw Chris Black, blood king to the grizzer that bit Jim Bridger's ass, and you are molesting my hunt. I'm Jeremiah. I know who you are. You're the same dumb pilgrim I've been hearing for 20 days and smelling for three. How come you ain't been scout? <laughs> ain't been too lucky, huh? This place has been trapped out since 25. What are you doing here then? I hunt Grizz. Grizz? Grizzly bear, pilgrim. I collect the claws. I had one in the thicket back there, ready to shake hands, until you come along. Well, I'm sorry then. That you look. <laughs> Hungry too there. Well, come on. You know how to skin, Grizz. I can skin most anything. Sure are cocky for a starving pilgrim. Well, there she be. Go in, get warm, get yourself something to eat. I got a chore to finish. Now, boy, are you sure you know how to skin Grizz? Just as fast as you can find them. Ah! <laughs> 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 <laughs>
scan that one pilgrim and I'll bring you another. Precious armory. Gratefully accepted. I'm in the wood hauling business, and business is good. <laughs> huh? Digging that one to get earth for. Glove. Our merch also doubles as a broom. The what? Our merch? Shouldn't be chains on anything like that. It's very dangerous.
Yeah, I need to get the second floor. When you have a minute. I guess so. Cool. Thanks. He's here because I gotta, I'm gonna uh, hand the ten down to the hands. Well, if we cut out the window real quick. The chain, the chainsaws are here. I guess they were right about that whole 80% chance. <clears throat> However, did you get sick on this trip, Josh? <laughs> Raindrops keep falling on my head. Yeah, I was framing that window. I was like, gonna, I'm gonna go to swing it and the lightning bolt's just gonna hit it like Thor's hammer. <laughs> <laughs> Unlimited power! <laughs> Cabin build now! <laughs> okay, let's drop it. Yep. Doesn't this tower remind you of something? Yeah, that one movie. King Arthur, and these are my Knights of the Round Table. Whose castle is this? This is the castle of my master, Guidel Owamba. Go and tell your master we have been charged by God with a sacred quest. If he will give us food and shelter for the night, he can join us on our quest for the Holy Grail. Well, I'll ask him, but I don't think he'll be very keen. He's already got one, you see. What? He says they've already got one. Are you sure he's already got one? Oh yes, it's very nice. I told him we already got one. <laughs> well, uh, can we come up and have a look? Of course not. You are of English type, sir. Well, what are you then? I'm French. Why do you think I have this outrageous accent, you silly king? Well, what are you doing in England? Mind your own business. If you shall not show us the grail, we shall take your castle by force. You don't frighten us, English pea dogs. Go and boil your bottom, sons of a silly person. I blow my nose at you, so-called actor king. You and all your silly English king. <laughs> a strange person. Now look here, my good man. I don't want to talk to you no more, you empty-headed animal food trough water. I fought in your general direction. Your mother was a hamster, and your father smelled of elderberries. Is there someone else up there we could talk to? Ah, uh, no. Now go away before I taunt you a second time. Dinner is served. Oh, thanks, Cookie. Today we have white rice, candied yams, bell peppers, and onions, and 10 hour smoked pulled pork. Enjoy. Yeah, who did the smoking? The Rastafaris, I believe. <laughs>
farting? Yeah. Yeah! <laughs> Steady hand. Hot surgeon number one. Yakuza boss come to me. Need hot surgery. I do it. Yakuza boss die. I run. Come to America. Daryl give me job. I killed Yakuza boss. <laughs> <laughs> Eyeball level. Good. Kentucky level. Kentucky level. <laughs> Your whole thing is built on Kentucky level. <laughs> Except for my door, of course. <laughs> I don't know how much of your boot you put under there. It's got to match that side, roughly. Oh. I um, think, uh... Roughly. Uh, about a boot and a half. <laughs> boot! Boot and a half! <laughs> now, yeah, you can go to Ikea and buy one of them fancy futons where it has all the instructions, right? Right. Or you can go in Mother Nature. Of course. Find you a couple nice trees. Of course. Mm-hmm. Of course. Cut them. Roughly. Roughly. Uh, is that, is that one's on that post? Is that able to scooch? Mm-hmm. Oh. And she's solid. She's solid. <laughs> she holds it. Well, I can, it's, uh, 11th rib high. Uh, here, well, I got it, I got it, I got it. That, no, son, that's your fifth rib. Look, at that's where you put a needle D. Now, how you can figure out where to place the needle D, you take the patient's hand, put it underneath their rib cage, in these two spots, they can't see. <laughs> <laughs> these two spots is where you place a needle D compression, all right? Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. <laughs> Mid-axillary. Uh-huh. Now, on the left side, you want to make sure you... You do not hit the heart. Do not hit the heart. <laughs> it's preferred to go mid-clavicular, second, second rib down. Mm -hmm. Second intercostal space. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, you could always do a finger phonchotomy if you are well enough first. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, uh, end the video. I <laughs> love God. Lord, let me get just one more. <laughs> Have I ever asked you, do you like guacamole? Friends and no power tools. Ikea got nothing on us, homes.
体験。